Okay, here I have Evangelion Unit 2 built as a Lego, and it's been a few days I've been wanting to make a video of this guy and put it on YouTube, show him off. Uh, I came across a Evangelion Unit 1 miniature in the same exact size, and he was built out of Legos as well, obviously, and I wanted to build one of my own, but I decided to do Evangelion Unit 2 instead. And uh, I think it turned out quite well. Yeah, yeah. Uh, not all the colors are exactly right, but I don't exactly have those parts for those areas, like the white here for the shoulder, uh, uh, elbow, elbow, and I got like a black one over here. So now the colors are exactly right, like with some of the orange and mix match colors here and there, but I think I did pretty well. My computer's currently across the room, so I can't really tell with the screen whether I got this guy in the shot or not. Can you zoom in? Hang on a minute. There we go. And zoom in a bit more. There, that's better. Thank you. Maybe if I turn the light, it'll be better as well. Mm. Is that better? There. As you can see, I got the four eyes going on using the Lego binoculars. and took a while to get the neck piece in there. Luckily, I had an orange hinge piece here for the neck, which worked quite beautifully. And I decided to build the shoulder pylons, whatever you want to call them, and I gave them the rocket packs for the shoulder parts. And I, even though I would like to show you the articulation on the guy, I'm just not because he's just really weak and flimsy, but for example, like if his legs go in, they get all wiggly, you gotta pull it out. Let's see if I can show you. This little piece right here, it gets real wiggly when he gets pushed in, so you gotta pull that back out. But it's barely holding on. So, I'm not gonna mess around with him too much. But his knees can bend, his feet can go side to side, not really spin or anything. Um, he has... Uh, his waist is articulated as well, so you can bend that forwards once. But that's pretty much it. You can open up his chest pieces here to show off his core. Or her. I can't remember if it was a female for the Ava Unit 2. Should kind of see that in there. The red piece right here. Took a while to find out how to put it together completely, but I think I got it. Got the umbilical cable here to give it its juice. And uh, here I'll just bring up the uh, Evangelion Unit 1 that I based this guy off of. Okay, so we're just going to go onto the internet here. We're going to type in brick shelf, and we're going to click on the website that pops up and type in search gallery AVA search that and it's usually on either the second or third page and uh, there it is and she got these pictures here of the guy that I based off of unit 2 off of of course it's not exactly purple and green it's more gray and green but eh, still pretty cool uh... here's his back and over here we have him with his hands out like getting ready to attack and over here 
got him running action. And it's just his head in front. And then we got him over here on silver ready for battle. So that's pretty much where I based him off of. So yeah. That's pretty much it. And uh, if you haven't seen Evangelion 2.0 yet, it's 2.22 or 1.0 for that matter. It's 1.11. I recommend that you go see him. Bye. This guy's bigger than Unit 1, the Revel Tech. Like, look at this. He's massive.